Apple's new iPhone 15 series was launched in India on the same day as the rest of the world. Thanks to India's Make in India initiative and the Production Link Incentive Scheme, Apple has been manufacturing its iPhone 15 right here in India. They have even set up their own retail stores. But here's the twist iPhones remain significantly pricier in India compared to the US and the UAE. Why is that so? Firstly, iPhones are not completely made in India. They are assembled here, but many critical components are imported, attracting custom duties. Take the display for example, the most expensive part, made by Samsung. It faces a hefty 20% import duty. The printed circuit board, essential for custom processors, diodes and transistors, faces similar taxes. On top of this, there is an 18% GST which is standard for all smartphones adding up to a 40% price bump. And it's not just Apple. This is the same reason why other flagship smartphones also carry a hefty price tag in India when compared to other nations. In Apple's case, they don't manufacture all iPhone models in India, which prevents dual pricing tiers. Additionally, currency depreciation plays a significant role in iPhone pricing. While the iPhone may be expensive in India, it is relatively cheaper in other countries. However, there is an interesting twist this year. Unlike last year when a strong dollar led Apple to increase prices globally, this time smaller dollar fluctuations causes varied price adjustments. Apple raised prices in Japan and for the Pro models in India, but surprisingly lowered them in Europe. China on the other hand saw no price increase, possibly due to concerns about a weaker economy and political issues. So where can you snag an iPhone at a better price? If you're traveling abroad or have relatives returning, take note, iPhones are more affordable in the US, Canada, Australia, China, Singapore, and the United Arab Emirates. Follow and subscribe to Business Standard for more such news views and insights.